Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Lord David, and this is XCOM UFO Defense. Let's keep it going, shall we? I'm back into this. It's the first of February, new month, new beginnings. And let's see what we can do in this one. So I'm going to keep the time ticking. I've just ordered a load of things, scientists and soldiers and whatnot. We'll do that when the time comes. But there we go. We've completed our laser pistol production. So we can now put all of our engineers into the medkits. I'll take another four days. Let's get that done. So there we go. A lot of scientists, a lot of engineers. So I'll put my engineers to work first. There we go. Short time by nearly a day. Reset is going up a five on them both. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. And new soldiers. So here we go. New soldiers. Scott Sharp. He just makes it. I'm going to call you uh, Scotty. There we go, Scotty. Okay, Paul Johnlan. He's not that good even. So, Paul can be. Gary. So Gary with two R's. Gary, there we are. <laughs> uh, Uda Ungla. Wow, that's not bad at all. Firing's pretty good, form pretty good, very brave. Health could be better. Quite strong. We'll call you Daniel. And my next Bernard. Bernard's just as good, but his firing actually isn't that good. I'm going to leave you as Bernard. And was there anyone else? You Taka? No, you uh, Kaka. You Kaka. There we go. So only one terrible soldier in our batch, not bad. There we go, let's get rid of him. Or her. I wasn't sure if it was a guy or a girl, you Taka. Could be replied. So it looks like we've got. Why do I find out how many soldiers I've got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I've got 23 soldiers. Decent soldiers, anyway. Let's have a look at my equipment. Do I use a second auto cannon? This is the question. See, I don't mind the heavy cannon because it's a bit more damaging than the auto cannon. But the auto cannon's more bullets, you can snap and auto shot. Leave as is for now. Yeah, we'll leave it as it is for now. Let's just keep on going. Research complete! Alien alloys. Alien crafts. Uh, alien craft are constructed from special alloys with unique properties. They are extremely light and durable and can be molded by electromagnetic methods. This material can be re re can be reproduced and used in many kinds of manufacturing processes. Okay, so now we can re we can research the personal armor, which I wouldn't mind getting right now. Right, right there we go. One of them reprints was alive, and the medic is alive. Yeah, so we'll go for the personal armor. I definitely want that. Definitely want that personal armor. And I can manufacture them alloys I was talking about. So that was a pretty good research there we just did. Let's keep it going. Let's see if we can do any more before anything comes at us. Let's keep that time going. Keep the time going. We'll go there. Let's go, let's go there. There we go. Medikits are done. Let's go to the research, uh, manufacturer. So it's 3,000 for every alloy that I make, so let's make... Let's make 20 of them. Three days, that's all right. Let's go 30. Go five days, yep. Yeah. Five days. There we go. Let's keep that going. Day, 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 day. So UFO number four detected. Small. It's very high. It's heading east at 2,700 miles per hour. It's right next to my base. Alright, so I'm going to send an interceptor one at this one. So there we go. Target UFO number four. 
it's going very fast, so I don't even know if our interceptor can keep up with it. It doesn't even look like it can. No, your full track and lost. So go to its last known place and see if you can pick it up again. It doesn't look like it, so let's keep it going in that, that their direction. There we go, UFO number four. We found it. So select a new target. I'll tell you what, I'm going to send in interceptor two out for it now as well. Because interceptor one is losing fuel. But never mind, it did catch it. So we can't do this UFO. It is a fairly long one. So we're going for the standard attack. Give our have a like missile. There we go. It only takes two. Straight down. No problem at all. The only main problem I do have there is it's landed at night. So hold on. Whoa, whoa, where are you going? Turn the base. You've already, you've already, it's already done. It's already done, mate. He's at home. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to let time pass for a bit. So it does take a bit of time for the Sky Ranger to get to its location. Because doing a mission at night is very, very hard. That's what she said. Whee! Never mind, right. I'm going to send the Sky Ranger now. Hopefully by the time it gets there, it will be morning. And we can do this mission at daytime. So there we go. It's slowly becoming day. Let's get that. Let's get this crash site done as well. We need all the resources, of course. So whatever we can salvage is going to be great. This is actually the first one we shot down, I think. So crash site. Sky Ranger landing here. Crash site. Exercise caution. There may be operatives in the UFO or right. This will be successful when all enemy units have been eliminated or neutralized. Cover of UFO remains and max alien carpenters can then be initiated. Come on to the ship, blah 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 blah, get everyone on the ship, run away. Right, so I believe this is our first crash site. Because all of our other UFOs have landed, I believe. Right, what am I doing? What am I doing? Right, some area, you get the auto cannon as I use. There we go, there's your bullet pit. And I'll tell you what, I'm going to give a G to this. I think you'll like a big, nasty cannon to blow people up with. There we go. Next, I've got to get the smoke grenade, which Boris has. We'll give that to Vegeta. There we go. Right. Turn number one. Looks like we're in the top corner. Potentially we're in the top corner. So, as always, we start off with a smoke grenade. Let's get this through. Not enough time units. You can't... F oh my god, Vegeta, you suck. Right, never mind. Let's save the game. Battle number on the battle one, yep. There we go. End the turn. So I'm going to have to wait, waste two turns now to get out of the ship. Because Vegeta is a pansy, apparently. Yeah, it was a bad idea giving them the heavy cannon. He hasn't got enough strength to hold it. Should have really looked into that. Anyway, I right, that'll do it for then. There we go, turn two's over. <laughs> I think I left him with a grenade as well. I think I let him, let him to drop that grenade he's got. Drop that. Right, so I've got no rookies to go out this time, so it's send some Mary up. She doesn't see anything. Oop, now she does. It's the floaters. It's still the floaters. Tell you what, let's... You wait there. Wait, Vegeta. Tell you what, you get in there. there you so I assume you can see the same one, yeah. Right, so... 
Maverick, you're a new guy, let's get you out. Right, can you shoot this guy for me? Shot. Do it again now, please. It's still alive. No, Maverick. Damn it. Never mind. He did shoot it twice. I mean, you know, good on the lad, but... It just wasn't good enough. So, Vash, you're going to have to try and finish this job for me, mate. Come on. I know you can do better than that. My god, it's still alive. Do it again. One more try. Come on. Oh my god, he's taken four shots. I think we've hit him four times. He's still moving. Come on. <laughs> oh my word. Right, someone else get out of here now and shoot this bloody alien here. Run out, run out, come on. Don't even think about it, just turn and shoot, turn and shoot. Come on. Ah, missed him. Come on, one more. Ah, I missed him. Damn it, man, damn it. This will not end well if I can't kill this guy right now. Come on, get out. Come on, you've got it. Come on, let's get it go. Let's get it done. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. me. Ah, oh, no, you failed me. You failed me, mate. It's going to get bad. Right, come on, Richard. You can do this. You can do this, Richard. Oh my god. Come on, one more go. Come on. Come on. Hit the bugger. Hit him. Yes. It's still alive. There's no way. Keep it all. I need you. I need you right now to cause some damage. Yes! Yes! <laughs> oh my word! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven operative shot at him. Uh, oh yeah, I lost the guy. Yeah, seven. Right, that'll do. That'll do for ten. One for my guys outside. Wow, that guy was the business. <laughs> Like, how much damage did that guy actually take? Jesus. Let's go into here. Into the apple orchard. Right, I've got to spread me guys out now, so come on. Let's get spread. Make sure there's nothing there. Any signs of the UFO? There it is. So let's keep it going, Kirito. You can run to the front. There we go. So, Mary, I want you at the front as well. Just so they're in good positions to uh, be shooting people. Vegeta, you can do the same. You're a bit weighed down with that heavy cannon. Right. Into the wheat fields. Come on. Vash, I want you to go south as well with Kirito. Next we have... I should be pressing this one. I forgot next, Tanaka. Come on then Tanaka, let's get you out. Next I've got Rita. Rita's there uh, doing on a few missions now, I get not you? Sure, I mean she's killed, but she's definitely doing well. Right, next, Stephen. Yep, he's been on a few missions as well. He's not doing too bad. Right, next, 
we've got Goku. Come on, Goku. Oop! Oh, damn it! Stop being an idiot, Goku, and get back outside the ship. Come on. That'll do. Right, that'll do for now. Got plenty of guys out now. Got a little spread going. Hopefully, we can converge on the UFO. I'm assuming there's not going to be too many because this is a shot down ship. You can't tell we've shot it down from here, like, but it's definitely a shot down ship. Let's keep on moving people out. Still no sign of anyone. You've went there. Camera there. Maybe you've run out a bit. Down. Who's this? Tanaka. You go where Levy was. Steven, you went to the front here as well. Uh, I am trying to be cautious, but I am just running people in at this point. Look at that. that. Right. There's sometimes usually one or two down there. So, Vash, let's see what you can see. I mean, you are going to walk into some smoke here, so you have got some cover. No! Ah, damn it. Well, at least he didn't move. Right, so, Kirido, I'm going to try and get you to hug the fence. Vegeta. Want him on this side of the fence. Let's spin this way. Hunker down. There we go. Right, some area. No, let's not move you yet. Richard. Seems okay. Rita, do the same. Yeah, let's keep doing all the same things. We'll keep doing all what we can. Do 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 some area you can wait there. Right, go who's gonna go with that squad? Alright, I'll do. I'll do, I'll do, I'll do, I'll do, I'll do. There we go, right. Ten five. Let's see what happens now. I'm, I'm assuming there's gonna be one oop, there's the one next to the ship. But I'm assuming there's gonna be one on the left side of the map. In that little nest of cabins or whatever they are. So, I'm going to run Vash down there. You never know, there might not be anything down here, but... Ooh. My God. Nearly, it's two of them. There's bloody two of them. Right, so, Vegeta. Have you got an accurate shot? You do. Can you hit this one? Yeah, it's a good shot. Vegeta, good shot. Right, next. Silmeria. Can you hit the other one? We'll do a snapshot. Looks like it's going to miss. I try again. Oh. What the hell happened there? My god, that was close. Tell you what, don't do that again. Let's, let's move you a bit closer. So that doesn't happen again, hopefully. Right, Kirito looks like he's got a shot, so let's do that. Tell you what, I'm going to hunker him down. So you do get a bit of accuracy boost. So let's shoot the disc. Looks like they were no good. Let's try again. Come on, Kirido, you're meant to be the captain. Show me how it's done. No. Try again. Come on, you're going to go up. Where the hell are you shooting, mate? Oop, oop, no. You did. Do you have time for one more? You do. Let's try that. It looked better, but it hit the fence. Vash, you're not in a very good space. 
There he goes. Like, reader, can you see him? Doesn't look like it actually. No, I don't think so. Okay, so Goku. I think Goku might be able to get a couple of shots in. So let's try that. Good shot, Goku. Ooh. I think I recognise the guy's weapon. And I think it was a stun launcher. Which could have been very, very bad for me. If it actually got a shot off with that stun launcher. Because it's pretty much like a, a massive explosion in my air. Like, you could have shot it at Kirito. And it would affect like all three of them then. Probably knock them all unconscious. Which is not what we want. Of course. So let's see if we can find this over here. That was over here. There you are. So let me hook it down. Well, let's get a couple of shots on coming out. Let's see what you can do. So next I've got Steven. He looks like Steven's already got a shot. Yeah, he does. Let's see if he can actually pull it off. A bit closer. A little bit closer. Come on. That's further away, come on. Closer. That one's in the sky somewhere. Alright. Try again. Nope. Ah, so close. Nope. No. no. One more. Shut the ground in front of him. Yes, there we go. One oh, shot. Yeah. I mean, it took him like nine, but you know he got there in the end. That's all that matters, getting there in the end. So I'm going to move you, move you, Levy. You have to move as well. You can hook me down there. So Yamcha, Boris, Samaria. Oop, Rita hasn't moved. So let's get Rita. I'm going to run Rita this side of the ship. Because there was some aliens over there, so we'll go that way. Right. So there we go, that brings it to another 10. This video is starting to get a bit long for me, so I am going to bring it to a close now. We will finish it up on the next part, so don't worry, I will be finishing off this, this mission off for you. So thank you very much for joining us, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully I'll see you again in the next one. And take care of yourself.